Seriously, I feel like everything in my house is falling apart. The garage door now. So I'm going to see if I can capture this on video, see if I can actually fix it. What I think is happening is this center section, when it goes up, it's drooping really low, so it impacts it going back down. It makes a horrendous sound. See that drop? When it goes back down. So I'll see if I can figure out a way to make it not droop. That should be fun. Basically all the pieces, the garage door is so old that it's cracking. The actual metal is ripping in spots. It's like ripping all over the place. There's a rip. All of the light coming through there is a rips. So basically, the metal pieces are solid. This aluminum is just so flimsy that it's literally just shredding where there's a weakness. That's great. All right. See if that worked worth a crap. They just put a big old metal bar in there and screwed it in with these two. This is the existing one. Those two I just put in. This has got pressure on that side. Stand back. Who knows what's gonna happen. <laughs> I actually think it's going to break it more. didn't work. No. Attempt number two. Just put a little piece of wood in there. Just see if it stays, it keeps it from dropping. Puts enough pressure on it to not drop. It's like a shim. Like a shim in there. I don't know if that'll work or not. No. No. <laughs> well, look out. Alright, so after watching a couple of YouTube videos, I think I found out what might be happening. And I, So when I'm looking at this, this is hard to tell, 
this piece, there's two pieces. This piece comes down and connects to this, and then this arm connects to there. This one is disconnected. You can't see very good, but it's not connected to this arm. It's not connected to the door panel. So my fix is going to be to put a whole bunch of screws in this to try to affix it. Yeah, I said affix to this door piece and then put this back on it. Let's see if that works. So this is obviously moving. I might put a piece of wood back behind here or something to try to secure it. So that's the plan. Step one, I don't know if this is going to work or not, but this is now screwed into that with a whole bunch of bolts onto the arm. These are only held in by pop rivets. So that one may break eventually too. All of these may eventually break. Alright, that's everything put back together. I'll see what happens. good because it's dark. So I'm going to stand over here. I'm watching that one right there. Fix attempt number two was to put a piece of wood in there. <laughs> uh, so it doesn't make as bad a sound. Oh. Still falls. Right there. So the falling is not good. At least it doesn't pop anymore. <laughs> Why I did not do this in the first place, I don't know. Process of trial and error, I think. So, I just ended up screwing a 2x4 all the way across those pieces and watch this. <laughs> <laughs> Flawlessly, and it looks awesome. <laughs>